An Army veteran hurt in Iraq is getting help from his community back home here on the Sun Coast. SNN Local News 6 reporter Calvin McClure joins me now with more on his story. And I understand, Calvin, he could have died from his injuries. Exactly. U.S. Army Staff Sergeant Juan Roldan lost both of his legs in Iraq and is struggling to return to civilian life. But he is receiving help from local organizations that will get him back on track and making a better way for his daughter. Legs are on everything. U.S. Army Staff Sergeant Juan Roald Dan lost both of his legs while serving in Iraq in December of 2006. Since then, he's been in and out of hospitals undergoing numerous surgeries. His latest was this past Monday. Last year, the national organization Homes for Our Troops called Home Builders Association of Manatee and Sarasota County and asked if they get involved in building a home for Roald Dan. They completed the home in Parrish last December. I said, well, wh where's, your, where's all your furniture and stuff? And he says, I don't have any. I have nothing. The HBA then decided to use donations collected during the 2011 Sarasota Slam Fishing Tournament to begin funding the purchase of much needed furniture for Roald Dan and his family. With help from local civic groups, the HBA raised nearly $15,000, which will be used as store credit at the Sears Appliance and Furniture Store. Wednesday, Roald Dan and his mom were busy picking out couches and a special request from his five-year-old daughter, Brianna. I'll definitely be looking for a white bed because She's into the old princess thing and she wants a white bed. Rodan is beyond grateful for the help he is receiving. He says it will provide a better life for his little girl he wears on his arm every day. He says she is his motivation and gave him a will to live after suffering his injuries. The love that I have for my daughter, my heart, and, uh, and the gratitude that I, that, I, that I have in life for being able to have her and for her to be able to have a father is more than I can imagine. HBA Executive President Alan Anderson is a Vietnam veteran. He says Roald Dan's story hit home. A house and even the furniture is a small part of what he's given. Uh, you know, that we should give that back. A part of me still doesn't believe all this. Because of them, I'll be able to provide a better future and, and a better uh, living conditions for my daughter. If you or your group is interested in assisting Staff Sergeant Juan Roldan, contact Alan Anderson at the HBA office by email at allen at hbamanatee-sarasota.org. Thanks a lot, Calvin. Now, if you didn't write that information down just now, you can also go to our Facebook page. Just look for SNN Local News.